Millie McIntosh asked her husband Hugo Taylor to suck out a blockage in her breast after battling an infection. The 32-year-old has been suffering with mastitis after giving birth to her second daughter eight weeks ago. The maid in Chelsea star was left in pain due to blocked milk ducts so asked her husband to help by sucking out the blockage, but he was not keen. She shared her struggles on an Instagram story, Hi everyone, just a little update, thank you so much for all your advice on mastitis. I've had so many lovely messages and am on antibiotics. I went to a women's health physio yesterday and had a really painful but effective massage and that has definitely helped a little bit. And also they used an ultrasound machine to help break down the blockage. The area is still sore but it's actually not red anymore because the area was bright red, so that's good. She added, I have asked Hugo to try sucking out the blockage but he is not keen so we won't be trying that. But what I am going to try today is Epsom salts with hot water in a hacker pump because loads of you said to try that. So I will keep you posted on how we are getting on. According to the NHS, mastitis is where breasts become swollen, hot and painful. It can affect men and women, but it's common with women who are breastfeeding. Symptoms include a swollen area on the breast that becomes painful to touch. There may also be a burning pain in the breast, which could either be consistent or just when breastfeeding. Millie, who welcomed Aurelia in November, is also mum to Sienna, 20 months. But she had a bit of a tough time towards the end of her pregnancy where she caught norovirus and gave birth by C-section. Posing in the hospital and holding her baby bump, Millie said, Firstly let me say that my birth experience was really positive, the playlist I made when I had Sienna was playing in the background, Hugo was there and I felt totally calm and ready, but that wasn't the case in the few weeks before. I was admitted to hospital two weeks before my C-section was booked in as they thought I was in early labor and having contractions brought on by throwing up after I caught the norovirus. Naturally I went into panic mode as I felt so unprepared and nervous, plus Sienna was poorly at home with hand foot and mouth and I knew she needed her mama. Do you enjoy reading about celebrities? Sign up for all the best celeb news from the mirror here. She added that the little scare made her appreciate her last few weeks before the baby came along and she enjoyed spending time with Sienna and Hugo. As a serial planner it freaked me out thinking the baby was coming early but luckily my second C-section was everything that I hoped it would be and just magical. I asked to drop the curtain and watch Aurelia be born, which was an incredible moment that I will treasure forever. I can't thank the amazing staff at the Kensington Wing enough for their care and support, during both of my stays, she ended her post. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at webcelebs at trinitamirror.com or call us direct 0207 29